All this week, we're helping you get back into the swing of things for a back to school. You see plenty of these flashing school zone signs this year and with good reason. Now we found following the speed limit around schools won't just keep you from getting a ticket. It could also save a life. Patrick Little is here now with a preview of the story you'll see tomorrow as part of our in-depth back to school coverage. According to the Transportation Research Board, over 100 children are killed every year walking to and from school and over 25,000 kids are injured. So we're taking a look at school zone speed limits and how important it is for drivers to follow them. We also talk to safety experts to find out what you can do to make sure kids stay safe. Even when school is in session, be aware that sometimes those school zone signs really do indicate the speed you should travel because school might be over, but that's still a place where kids go. Coming up tomorrow morning on Eyewitness News this morning at 6.30, we'll take a look at how much slowing down, just a small difference it can make, even if you're just slowing down just 10 miles per hour. It's a matter of life and death. I'm Patrick Little, Eyewitness News.